What's up y'all, DJ Girl here of Father of Fraternity. This is my daughter Ava. We're gonna answer some questions that LaGuardia has provided us with. We're gonna start off right now. We can't answer these questions with you digging in your nose. You got boogers. <laughs> okay, let's answer these questions. Ava, you see the camera? Yes? Okay. Ava, do you love daddy? Yes. Yes. Uh, Ava, is daddy your favorite parent? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Ava, would you ever lie to daddy? Yes. Aw, oh, man. Right now is 18 months. She's at the age where she um, repeats everything. She understands rhythm when it comes to songs. So we're trying to teach her her ABCs in rhythm. It's progressively getting better though. The second thing sounds crazy, but we're trying to teach her how to be more polite. She's great at saying thank you, but she doesn't say please. She knows how to say huh when she wants something or to point at something. We're trying to get her to say please when she wants something and what she wants us to do something for her. One of, these. One of the biggest things my daughter has taught me as being a parent now is how to relearn everything. And everything is brand new to her. So here we're in Ohio, it's snowing. And the snow hitting her face and blowing into the car when we um, put her in the car seat, it's something that she doesn't, you know, she's not used to that. She's never experienced that. So to us, we're hurrying up, we're um, brushing along, but to her, she wants to experience it. So relearn. You're welcome, you see the ducks? So her, being able to experience something for the first time, we have to relive it the same way. Yes. Baby. You see a baby? Where's, oh, you want your baby? Here's your baby. You're welcome. Um, another thing I've learned about myself is that my patience isn't as good as I thought it was. Um, not that I don't have patience for her, but just trying to make sure that I have the patience and knowing how to react to things in the correct way. Because of course, with us trying to teach her and her trying to learn things, you're welcome. You have to learn um, how to react. Because if you act in a negative way, or if you have short patience, or you don't take the time for them to learn, it's going to show in their development. So, so I think one of my biggest fails as a parent was when I was um, trying to baby wear her when she was about two or three months old. Taking a walk with her, sat down, unstrapped it, um, sitting around playing with her. So when I was going to get back up. L-M-N-O-P and when I got up, she flipped right out of my lap and almost at the corner of the table. When I, when I tell you that her whole life flashed before my eyes and how I would go to jail if she busted her head open and that was one of the biggest and scariest moments I've had as a parent. Now this might sound like a plug, but I actually go to my fatherhood fraternity Facebook group um, it's a group of fathers um, from all type of experiences and backgrounds and we have that group um, exclusively for fathers and father figures where we can ask questions with no judgment and we definitely um, get a lot of answers and get a lot of different perspectives whether it comes from um, bullying in school, um, breastfeeding, vaccines. Um, the Father of Fraternity Facebook group is been, has been very helpful for me. Other than watching um, other black father vlogs, um, our Father of Fraternity group has been the best. We're almost done, okay? A major thing that I wish I knew was that there's a lot of great black fathers and we have a lot of information to share and a lot of information to give. So it's always great to be able to connect with other fathers. It's really like a fraternity. We're going through experiences that we all have went through and that we all understand and we know the feelings of how your life changes when you become a father. I, I never knew love so strong. I never knew so much about myself until I had a baby. I wish I knew that life 
was going to be on such a different level when she came into my life. And it's been... You're welcome. And having her in my life has just been one of the greatest things. I wish I knew that there was so much joy and entertainment and laughter with having a little human that acts like me when I don't even know how she learned how to act like me. I love the way that I'm learning new things learning new experiences, new ways to be more safe about myself. I wish I knew that I needed to take care of myself a lot earlier, but it's just something that comes with having a daughter or having a son or having a child, period, that your whole life changes. And I wish I knew the joy that was about to happen into my life. I'm thankful that God brought her into my life when he did because there's really no better time and no greater gift than having a daughter that has been as fun as this already. In these 18 months, I've learned more about myself than I have in the 34 years prior to having her. So um, I just never knew that it was gonna be like this. And I, and I wish I knew that there was gonna be so much joy. No. Against all lies, mama, I made it. You already know it's your favorite. <laughs> Say bye bye. See you later. Blow him a kiss. Mm -hmm. Say bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Alright, we're done. See y'all later.